Okay, guys, we have a very exciting trailer reaction coming up right now. Um, I don't know if you've heard about this. Grand Theft Auto, the illegal action of stealing someone's car. Um, <laughs> and then turned into a hit video game. One of my favorite video games. And I really only play like three video games. I play I've played World of Warcraft, Call of Duty, Fortnite, and then Grand Theft Auto. Also 2K sometimes, but I prefer to ball up in real life just because I'm so skilled. Um hey, that's what's up. Sometimes those skills don't transfer to the basketball court, you know? <laughs> um but today I'm joined by a very special guest, one of my besties, and also a uh um I mean, I'll just say it, prolific podcaster, you know? Yeah. Um <laughs> I don't know about prolific. <laughs> RB3, welcome to the trailer reaction. Hey, thanks for having me. Thanks for having me. Yeah, no, we had to get this one in because, um, A, we used to play GTA 5 all the time together back at uh, back in college. And then, B, we went to Miami together for the timestamp, uh, you know, for, for our timestamp uh, short film festival where we won a bunch of awards, where we claimed ourselves the GOATs, basically. You know? Right. And I honestly am worried that they might have based this game off of our experience there. Uh, <laughs> Because we had some crazy times in Miami. We yeah. went there during spring break. Uh, it was just a coincidence. It was during spring break. And all the spring breakers were there. We got locked out of our Airbnb. We had to call a locksmith. We had people busting down doors. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, it's a good time. Um, so, yeah, we lived it up in Miami. So I'm curious to see how this game now set in Miami. Because one of my favorite parts about GTA 5 is that it's set in L.A. And us living in LA, we can like look at the game in real life and be like, oh, I'm flying a jet right into my apartment, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was like GTA 5 was like tailor made for somebody like me because the main the main storyline was following a, gang, a, a former gangster who wants to become a film producer, movie producer. And then the side storyline is about, you know, a, 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 black, a black guy from Compton like trying to hustle his way to the top. So it was like, if they kind of like, Lab created a game specifically for RB3 is like GTA 5 was there. So I'm curious to see Damn. how much you're going to love GTA 6, though. You know, our GTA, I've never played the campaign in GTA 5, but it definitely sounds like it's like the RB3 simulation. Like, uh. <laughs> no, literally, I probably played that campaign at least like seven, eight, nine times over, like easily. Uh, and because I mean, this game's been around for 13 years. So wow. And then they have their third character, Trevor, who is like a complete psychopath maniac which i think for 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 this one for uh grand theft auto 6 it feels like this game's gonna be all trevors you know what i mean like all just <laughs> florida men florida men and women so yeah that's exciting yeah there's gonna be just non-stop florida men content because that's i guess where it's uh in miami mm. um i my move in gta honestly i think i think you introduced me to gta uh in a way that like i actually mm. got into it because we started playing with the uh sort of like open world like no yeah. consequences sort of mm -hmm. like just do whatever you want yeah. and that was really fun to me and i always would go straight to the airport and steal a plane <laughs> every yeah. time without fail um yeah. and it's go to the mil the military base and um <laughs> i love using the cheat codes too where you're like flying through the air and like uh basically just untouchable god mode pretty much <laughs> yeah no cheat codes are awesome man it's lit Okay, so let's get into this trailer reaction. Inappropriate for children. Music Lucia, do you know why you're here? For one, wow. these, these graphics are impeccable, for one. Yeah, I was like, is this real? Is this film or is this animation? <laughs> I can't, I honestly can't tell. Yeah, even when I like texted the trailer to my girlfriend, she, she literally thought it was like a live action like adaptation. And I was like, nah, <laughs> this is the video game. It's a video game. Yeah, it's giving. It's giving. Good luck, I guess. There's us on the beach. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, you guys? Timestamp made it all the way out to Miami Spring Break. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Oh, and even the music right off the bat, like, it's like 80s, like, hyper sort of pop, like, the weekend vibe. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's funny because, like, I think the GTA is GTA Vice City. Yeah, GTA Vice City was also set and Miami, the map, like they call, they call Miami Vice City and then they call um, New York Liberty City and they call Los Angeles Los Santos, you know what I mean? So like, I think the, they did have uh, GTA Vice City and, and Vice City uh, Liberties or something, or Vice City Chronicles or something like that. I, I played too, like back in the day. So it was like, they return into the Miami location, but this is- Oh, so they've been to, I thought it was only ever in LA. 
Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, the um, this one, yeah, the Vice City is like Miami. They did Miami, and then GTA Four is actually New York. So I know you're from New York, so you might want to check out GTA. Yo, 4 okay. Yeah. What and year then, did that come out? Um, I think Four came out. I don't know, man. It was probably like 20, 2010, 2011, something like okay. that. Okay, okay. Um, but I will say too, though. Um, you talk about the '80s point. I think Vice City was also set in the '80s, so this one's set in modern times, and that's that's what's dope. Oh, okay. Modern times. Mm -hmm. Here we go. They're gonna have you gliding through the the bayou, getting yeah. some shrimp scampi. <laughs> <laughs> the shrimp on the barbie, eh? <laughs> Damn! Look at all these beach dwellers. I know it's gonna be so fun running over all these people. It's gonna be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stealing a jet ski for sure. Oh yeah. Oh, that's that's also you see all the jet skis, the boats. Like I'm sure all this stuff is all playable. Like yeah, helicopters too. Yeah, yeah. I'm here for that. I wonder if you steal a plane if you can fly to the Bermuda Triangle. We'll see. <laughs> she said she cared about me. She tried to make my world. Wait, that looks just like the club that we were at all night. That that that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, minus the strippers, but right, right. But it does look like that. Does look like the club we was at. You ain't mind about that though. That is definitely the club. And then the guy next to, and in the in the next shot, the guy looks like Kodak Black, like this dude right here. I'm like, yeah. is this Kodak Black at first? I was like, man, this. Yeah, they they go crazy with like the Florida the Florida references here. Is 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 nuts. I remember when we were there, we this dude showed us like the um like the maze of like uh, trains that were like happening in Miami. Like it was like you could get on a train anywhere and like it was like a sky rail situation. Oh yeah, yeah, I remember, you remember that. that? Yeah, he was yeah. like leading us down like that hallway. Yeah. So I feel like they are probably gonna have like those trains in here too. Oh yeah, oh yeah, got to, got to, got to. Ooh, high rises too. Like you could go up to like a skyscraper and like do Jump some. Off. <laughs> Yeah, that do some do some anarchy like. <laughs> oh yeah, a lot of lot of lot of lot of hell could be rained from this uh from this game for sure. Wait, this is the part that looks the most photorealistic because it's like social media posts. Right, 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 and I, I guess like I don't know if you saw on Twitter, but they had saw they did like a side by side comparison. I guess a lot of these were like real videos that like were real like Florida people videos and then they like recreated them <laughs> in Oh this my God, that looks like Jeff Bezos. Oh yeah. <laughs> hey Poppy, save some sugar baby for the rest of us. <laughs> From Dad Boss Squad. Dad Boss Squad. Hey, it kind of is giving rap shit on the uh, <laughs> HBO Max. That's facts. Also Miami. Also Miami. Also Miami. Damn, Miami's a vibe. <laughs> the alligators. <laughs> I'm wondering, is that the same alligators before? Is that a different alligator? Or <laughs> <laughs> I think it's probably the same one. <laughs> that's that's the main villain besides your inner demons. Is this <laughs> is this alligator? alligator. The body cam footage too. Did they have that in GTA Five? They had a little bit of it, but I think it just looks it just looks so much better now. It looks so real. Like this looks yeah. unbelievably real to me. The way that they when they combine their like 4K or like 8K animation with like passing it through like a 720 like filter something like filter, that. it looks mm -hmm. extra realistic. That's crazy. All right. Dude. I just can't get over what these people are doing. <laughs> like one dude's watering the with his sausage out, like, <laughs> and then, <laughs> and what's this guy, right? Like, <laughs> all of it, all of it. It like, reminds what? me of Danny Duncan. Do you know Danny Duncan? No, I don't. I don't know. I never met the Danny YouTuber. Duncan. Oh, he's Dan like oh. a he's a Florida man who just like does crazy shit. Oh, <laughs> they might have used one of his real videos in here or something, like one of his inspirations. Probably. So is he driving with his foot? Like, is that what's happening yeah. there? Yeah, he's got his foot on the wheel. What, you never done that? <laughs> ghost ride the whip? Things. Go that is ghost riding the whip. That's <laughs> taking it to the next level. Right. Oh, 
Oh, do they have the MAGA freaks too in this game? Hey, <laughs> in the mud, like slinging mud and stuff. Like, yeah, they're like, my child will not be educated. I don't care what you say. <laughs> oh, they got, nah. they got Ron DeSantis in here too. Right. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, in the background. Oh yeah, for sure. Like, <laughs> <laughs> with his uh, fake cowboy boots. Yeah. <laughs> hey, there are really hills underneath. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. Well, look. Oh. <laughs> This is one that looked most real to me. I had to do like a few different takes on this. Like, are you sure this one isn't? They didn't film this one. That's <laughs> terrifying. That one, yeah, with two hammers. Like, because <laughs> Florida has like a huge retirement community. People like literally go there to retire. But then there's also like all this anarchy too. It's like Florida was not even ever meant to be inhabited like no, by no. people. Who's back? The only way we're gonna get through this by sticking together yo did you hear that um this dude is based on a real guy and that the real guy's like trying to sue rockstar games oh i didn't know he was trying to sue i heard i heard it was based on the real guy but i didn't know he was like trying to sue them <laughs> yeah what's his name what's that dude's name like this is random but you remember when we did that uh interview with anthony padilla and it was like that dude with the clown uh yeah the barber uh the the barber. richie the barber richie clown. the barber yeah 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 yeah, uh, yeah it's kind of giving me his vibes right here. it is you know what I mean? I wonder if he's a playable character. <laughs> well, this is actually, this is going to be history. This is the first time a GTA game's ever had a, a woman, um, you know, being the uh, central protagonist. So uh, that's cool. Oh, for real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's I'm, dope. So I see what that goes. Florida Joker. Oh, shoot. So this is the dude. Florida man with Joker face tat accuses GTA 6 of using his likeness. Lauren mm. Sullivan, known online as the Florida Joker. <laughs> He's literally the Florida Joker. I think I might be the California Joker. I just have to get the tats. <laughs> and then, yeah, P. Diddy might be the New York Joker. You know what I mean? Like, oh! <laughs> got the ultimate super villain. Um, yeah, he has goons on goons. <laughs> but this dude literally became famous off a of mugshot. <laughs> oh, wow. Hey, look, that's like that, that pretty dude who became famous for like two seconds, too. Remember him? Like Jared Leto? Not <laughs> that too, but yeah, there was one guy who was like super, he had like a super angular face, but he got like, um, but like, oh, Matt, Matt Rife, Matt Rife, <laughs> something like that, something like that. One of those dudes, anyway, somebody got fired, but this is this is going viral for the right reasons, I feel like, you know what I mean? It's cool yeah. how they're using all these real life, like Florida man references, but it's like, I don't know if they. I don't know if he has like the right to sue them for just creating a white character with face tats, like. Right, right. You know I don't what even I mean? think it's the same tattoos. They don't even look the same to me. Yeah, like look at this tat, and then look at the GTA character chat. Like it's pretty different. They're very different. Yeah, they're mad yeah. different. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if he's gonna win that case. Nah, nah. Interesting how it's in Spanish though, like the text is in Spanish. So. Yeah. Let's see. Here it is. We're gonna get through. So this is the protagonist. Yeah, yeah. So she's gonna be the main. I think the main character, and uh, well, I think it's gonna be like both of the guy and the girl. But because uh, we have like a G Bonnie and Clyde situation. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Yeah, because I think the other GTA characters is like one playable character. Then GTA Five was three, and I think this one's gonna be two. So it's gonna be her. I think the other dude's gonna be like the side, like another side piece. You know, kind of. This is gonna be so fun. Yeah, yeah. This is by sticking together, being a team. It feels like they captured like all the different communities in Florida. Like, I know it's just supposed to be Miami, but like Florida as mm. a state, I feel like has so many different communities. Like, at, like any state really, but like, mm. I don't know. Florida to me feels like has pockets of different like cultures and like yeah, and it feels like they got all of them in here, which is really cool. Yeah, it's like they got some Miami, some of like Briars County, some of like you know like the crazy like swamp people. It's like a, yeah, it's like you said, a whole mixture. <laughs> Trust. Trust. Uh, I just know that motel room is so humid. Right, right, right. Price smells awful too. Yeah. Trust. Let's go. That looks so good. Yeah, no, that's gonna be fire. That's gonna be fire. I'm definitely hyped for that one. Definitely hyped for that one. Yeah. Do you think they named it Vice because it's like the VI, like the six. Like, <laughs> I'm trying to figure out like which came first, like the name or the 
<laughs> or the city is taking place in. Yeah, no, nah, I mean, I definitely, I wonder, I mean, that might have been their decision for going to Vice City, you know what I mean? Because they did, they established it before, but yeah, this, I like this logo, man. It looks so like, yeah, that, um. Like retro wave, like. Exactly. Yeah. 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 No, nah, I'm hyped. I'm hyped. I, I Wait, think... it says coming 2025? What? <laughs> I know. I'm like, am I still gonna be alive by then? Or no, what? literally. <laughs> I'm probably gonna be drafted in the war by then. Come on. <laughs> yeah, man. I guess it's like, hey, listen, GTA Five is the biggest video game of all time, like ever made. So, uh, yeah, I can see they're they're like they're trying to take their sweet time with it, which I which I get. Maybe we could sign up to be like a test player or something. I don't know. Hey, whoever's watching, hey, somebody from Rockstar might be watching this video. Yo, hit us up. Let's, hit us uh, let's up. Game for you. You know what I mean? We'll give you our real takes. Yes, facts. Post credit scene. Post. <laughs> ah, just the logo. No. Nope. Hey. Wow. Um, I'm so excited to escape reality and go to Florida. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Yeah. No, I'm very very excited for this game. I'm gonna definitely pre-order it, get in line, whatever I gotta do. Like, I'm gonna get this as soon as it comes out, for sure, for sure. Yeah. Remember when we used to go to GameStop at like. 8 a.m. to get like the new Call of Duty, or I don't know yeah. if it was for you, but yeah, I would no, like, I that. yeah, yeah, that was crazy. Like, I, digital downloads were like starting to become a thing, but like weren't really doing it. So everyone just still going to the store. I remember, I, I remember when um, Call of Duty Black Ops came out, I literally called the GameStop and was like, yo, can y'all hold this under the desk? Like, please, like, I just, I will, <laughs> yeah. I'll slip you a five on the side. Just help me, help me out, please. Uh, all right. Well, thank you for joining me for this trailer reaction. Um, hey, man. And let us know in the comments what you're excited about if you're going to play this game. And see you next time. Bye.